Okay, let's look at how to build a snowman and I'm going to update the video because I did some changes to make it much easier. So let's look here. What you're going to do first is that you can choose a scene that you'd like to build on. Uh, and I would like to, let's say I'd like to choose this scene. And so that will be our scene. And let's select the body first um, for the snowman. I think I'm going to use this one this time and I'm going to choose the body and just grab both of them and I'm going to go into the scene. You just click at the bottom now and you get to the scene. You click on the slide and then they go here and then you can just uh, make it a little bit larger and then you go here for the next one and then that one gets a little bit larger as well. So you have to make them so that you're going to have a face that they're going to be able to see. And then we'll make that and then I'll just do the head and start going back. Okay, the head will be the last part of the body that you add. There we go. And then our next part, instead of having to go back and forth like I did before, you can just grab it and we need the arms. So I just click on it and it'll bring me back to the slide. I will do, uh, let's see, these two arms this time. Look, we only need two, so just grab the two. Control C, go back to the seam, and Control V. And I just did this with a student, and it took her about an hour because she had a lot of fun with it. And then you can just put them at the edge. Now we're gonna go to the eyes, the nose, and the mouth. And then I'm going to use, let's say I want to use this for the eyes. And hold on, go back to my scene. Touch the slide, then go back. Touch slide five. And we have the, I have the eyes and the nose are combined. And I'm going to choose the talking mouth this time. And I'm going to go back to my scene. Just touch the bottom. I'll take you back. So then you can just put his sunglasses on him. And then you can just add the mouth on top. And now I'm going to add the hat and the scarf. So I'm going to give him the tip, you know, the typical one. And let's go back to the scene. And let me touch the slide. You have to touch the slide. Then you go back to slide six and we need a scarf. I will grab the black scarf, go back to my scene. And the scarf, and then I need his mittens. And we'll get the mittens. I'm gonna go with I have red this time. I like red. And then go back to there and touch there and then I'm gonna get his um, boots as well because there are boots here. I'll do the gold boots this time and I'm gonna go back in Okay, let me go out and go back in this time. Okay, when you see the hand, that means you can go back in. Okay, now you can arrange everything. And I'm going to make it a little bit bigger. There, let me put his gloves on each side. So, well, that is his scarf. And as you can see, his head is a little more angled, so you can just use that part there to angle it. And then this would be his gloves, and this will be his hat, make it a little bit bigger. Put the hat on him. And this is my talking snowman. So now I have the snow and the buttons. Let's say I want to use three colored buttons. I'll grab three of those buttons. Well, Let's stick to this family because this family has his, 
that's all right, I'll stick to these for now. And go back to my scene. And just grab it from there. Touch, you have to touch your side. Now that you see have all of them together, you can actually make them smaller. And then you can put the buttons. Okay, and then the last and final step would be the snow. So then I will grab one of the snowstorms. I like that snowstorm. I'm gonna go back here the sign since this it's easier. And you just grab the snow and the kids are all set. And then they can draw and write a quick story about why they like this snowman. And once they've finished that, it's then you can just remove these. They're easy enough to remove. And they can write a quick story on why they like the snowman. You just insert a square, put it here. And put it down here or they can tell you what they did. Today I built a snowman using the pictures. My snowman is talking to me. I like my snowman. And then they they can share that with the class and show the class what they've done and that's easy enough so this is the new uh, build a snowman and i hope you enjoy it and i hope that you enjoy the updates as well that way you can get back and forth and it makes it a little bit easier have a great morning and i will talk to you soon